Hello, bitches, and we are back in GTA 5. We are here, and at least we have a nice vehicle here. Okay, so Lester wants to talk to us. I think it's time for a better car, yeah. Ladies were there. Okay, let's go and see what they want. Solomon or Lester? Well, uh, I don't know. Let's go and see what Solomon has for us. Oh, yes. This is fun ride. I know it is. Clear. Hey, well, Lila, you got my text? In that case. I think I got a modeling audition. Set some fat fucking old jackass on me, please. Big man. <laughs> we had a deal. We had paperwork. Hey. Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, you're a couple real badasses with a beat down on an old man. Hey, we don't take that. We have a deal okay. with them. Just about. Please. Get those millennial ass wipes. A pleasure. You oh. fuck what? Hey, Dead. here's an old man who might hit back. Definitely going to eliminate them. Have to catch them first, but. Ah, oh, this is total bullshit. Yeah, I know this car is horrible. Even catch them. Oh well. It appears they can't even drive. I tried to play nice. Oh. There is my weapon. I guess I didn't make it clear to you at the club. That's on you, dickwad. Yes. I told you to stay away. That's excellent. Excellent start. I'm only a paraplegic, but you can't feel anything. Ah, uh, <laughs> hey, you're throwing me softballs. A rum runner. But uh, speaking of accidents, those guys had one. Oh, if only we'd met 20 years ago, Michael. Maybe I wouldn't be in this mess. Yeah, you and me both, brother. Look, it's a pain, I know, but... Could you come by the studio now? I got something I'd like to show you. Absolutely. Yeah, of course. I'll be right over. Well, but I'm going to need a uh, vehicle. Destroyed my new vehicle. I should, should go and shoot them all. There's the shop in here. Let's go and buy some weapons. I have a feeling we're going to need them. Bean. That's a good one. Nice, okay. 
What else do we want? <laughs> Heavy shotgun, Rexman. Eh, why not? Okay. Armor. Heavy armor, yes. Heavy no, armor is always nice. With that, you hear? That's good. Anything else? No. Okay. We are ready. Now let's go and see the old man. Yeah, it's all your fault I was driving on the wrong side of the road. Ah. Wonderful. My car collection is here. <laughs> At wrong place. Turns out maybe I'm cut out for the movie business after <laughs> all, huh? My friend, you're a sentimental thug with zero artistic training and nothing interesting to say. I would say you're overqualified. <laughs> anyway, shut up and take a look at that. Oh. Oh. <laughs> nice. Fucking A. Feels good, doesn't it? Feels like I've finally done something with my life. Actually done something. A movie. Welcome to show business. Nothing but make-believe will ever feel quite real again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Michael, come on. Let me show you some rushes. I think you're gonna love it, but it'd be great to hear your notes. Hey, baby. I just wanted to tell you, I'm finally doing something with my life. I'm making a movie. A real one. Call me. <laughs> that is awesome. Now, let's go see Lester. See what kind of wonderful things he has. What is that? Okay, nothing for us. Well, we still have that, um, crap. that parachuting from the high above. Well, we'll just have to. To see what it is all about. Okay. Water looks very nice on the asphalt. Where are you, Lester? Car there, which been impound. Oh, yeah. I wonder how many of my cars are there impounded. <laughs> ah, less there wonderful place. Okay, let's go see what's going on. What we have to do. Oh, just enjoying a little labor dispute. See, we're about to do something really, 
really bad. So I need to present myself as a proper textile magnet, so... So you stop making anything? Nothing looks more suspicious in America than someone who's actually prepared to make something. <laughs> Jesus. What about you? Oh, pocket, Trevor. We're having some problems. Brad. Yeah, what else? Now, so anyway, the Union Depository is on hold for now. Can't do it without him, especially now that he knows. Thank God you guys are here. You alone? Davey, where's your boyfriend, Steve? <laughs> He's on his way up. Yeah, they're up here. Listen, this shit's about to hit the fan. Our entire lives together has been nothing but a series of fans and shits. Sort this problem out for me, and I will get Mr. Leisure Wear off your back. And if we don't? Then I will go to jail and you will get shot. Ah, fuck you, Dave. I've heard it all before. Not like this, you haven't. Has he briefed you? Oh, well, yes, he has. He told us that if we do what you say, then together we can take down the big bad wolf that is government <laughs> corruption. Yeah, and if you don't, we're all gonna fry. Because the agency's onto us. I've even got some fools in our own bureau that are questioning my methods. <laughs> think I'm a liar, <laughs> a cheater, <laughs> some kind of a killer and a thief. So? So, there's some uh, evidence. And I need you guys to find out what they know. All right, so what? You want Lester here to hack into the system, wipe it all clean? Oh, no, no, that will not work. The only way to access it is through your buildings. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> Michael, you'd be doing me a very big favor. And if you do this, I will make sure that all your files are deleted. I sure would. You. Hey! It's the last thing we do, and we're done. Period. Of course. I'm a man of my word. Dave, let's go! Come on, Lester, let's go. Good luck, gentlemen. I wouldn't, uh, didn't, um, trust that. Take us to the FIB building, parking lot entrance. Okay. Luckily, we are in, um, so how would I say? How we'll do this? Not suspicious vehicle. Yeah, not really, but I thought we'd start by finding a way into the building. We're going in through the parking lot? No, 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 no. We're waiting for someone to come out of it. A janitor. All right. And how's that going to get us in? Well, the janitors are all on temp contracts. They get replaced when their backs go or they ask for a day off. So we find one of these guys, we turn him, and that's our end. OK. Is there a particular guy? I'm in the temp company's database right now. We found a guy about to clock off. Look at the file here. Let me see. Okay. Harvey Molina, license plate. You should be coming out here soon. Somebody has broken my windshield. Looks Something's nice. coming. Uh, another guy. So, what do you think about this whole messed up situation? I think they'll either kill you after this is done, or keep you doing these stupid jobs until they don't have to kill you because someone else has done it for them. Yeah, that sounds about right. Come on. Here we go. Nope. So what do we do? Oh, what can we do? We do the job. And maybe you can delete the files when you're inside doing whatever else you're doing. That might be a way out. Yeah, well, a way out is exactly what I need. Tank is full, I can see. Can't even. That's it? My engine. That's not it. It's hard to get motivated on a job without financial incentive. You can't put a price on freedom. Well, that spur won't be there for the crew. I'm gonna ask Mr. Haynes for a budget. Maybe the leftover cash from the Polito score. We need something. Yeah, see what you can do. Ooh, what's this? This is not the car we're looking for. Come on. <laughs> How much longer do we have to wait here? Low eating engine. Ah, 
That's the one. Stay behind him, but don't let him see you. <laughs> let, yeah, sure. Luckily, I'm. So what's gonna happen when this guy gets wherever he's so going? He's gonna get his severance to be package. Able to put his... oh, I can't tell if that's some creepy euphemism or a plain statement of facts. It's whatever you want it to be. <laughs> okay. Hey, you mind? Put away the smartphone or pad or whatever the hell that is for a minute. No surfing while I'm trying to tail this guy. It's work-related. Yeah, well, I'd prefer all hands on deck right now, if it's okay with you. God, you're worse than my son. <laughs> if you want to break into the FIB's West Coast headquarters, you're gonna need more than a janitor's license plate number. And let me work on some angles while you, uh, keep this car behind that one and between these white lines. That's it. I mean, other than a few missing expletives in terms of racial abuse, that was my son in spades. <laughs> I just spoke with Agent Haynes. We've got the budget to pull this off. Good. Nobody's seen me tailing this block. This infernus. Come on. What do we do when he gets home? What do we need from him? We need cooperation. And maybe his overalls and an ID. And if he don't cooperate, awesome. you know what it's like to clean up shit for Steve Haynes? He'll cooperate. This is quite boring. Hello. Oh yes. If he didn't notice that, then maybe he ain't gonna notice anything. You let me know when you're running your fieldwork master class. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll show up. Oh no. My lights are gone. Wow. Well, this is what we do now. Driving behind somebody. Seriously, to wait and wait and wait. Wait, the hell does he leave? He's pulling up, parked down the block. Go in and have a word. Harvey Molina. Hey, Marilyn. How's that cable connection coming along? Fine, fine. Sorry, look, um, I'm busy. Only when she needs something. Jesus. Okay. Can't even get close to that. Interesting. Flip-flops. 
You got another one of those, Harvey? Who are you? The guy with your best interests at heart. They'll fill your pockets with money, and all you gotta do is take a little vacation. Hey, I work two jobs, man. I'll take any break I can get. Yeah. Hey, you want the beer? Nah, I'll just take the overalls. Oh, and your ID. It's in there. Oh, and Harvey. I probably don't need to say this. But you don't play ball? I'll be forced to do something I really don't want to do. Enjoy your beer. Okay, that was easy. But then again, if something like that happened to me, I would probably give him everything. Hi, how are you? Successful? Oh yeah. We gotta go back to my office. Oops. That was easy. Yeah. Guess you were right. Steve Haynes is a shitty boss. Hey, I called Frank while you were in there. He's coming to meet us. Yeah, huh? What do we need him for? Grunt work. Information gathering. What information? The plans to the office. There aren't any digital copies, or if there are, I'm not clever enough to find them. The architect is LS based, so I thought Frank could tail him, take a hard copy. Sounds complicated. You sure you need these plans? Yeah, I do. If I'm gonna find a way to bypass a couple of hundred million dollars worth of government security. Millions? They blew that much? Government contracts. License to steal. Wow. <laughs> we are in the wrong business. No, we've just taken the wrong contracts. <laughs> ah, he's already here. Okay. Into the office we go. Hey, what's the problem, dog? Steve fucking Haynes. Of course it's Steve fucking Haynes. <laughs> it's always Steve Haynes. That is not yeah. strictly true. It's either Steve Haynes or it's Trevor or it's his family. It's always one of them. Yeah, that's true. It is always one of them. Well, that old fuck with a horrible family and even worse friends. I told you, Franklin, I ain't a good role model. Period. Yeah, whatever, dog. It's either this or Dylan dime bags. The bullets come cracking at your ass either way. Yeah. We need to find out something about this FIB building, a weakness or a way in. Next time I meet a morally destitute, totally delusional, highly corrupt government agent. I hope he's a nice one. <laughs> Man, I'm not going in that motherfucker by myself. No, 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 no. Nobody is going in. We need to do some recon. We need a little more information. She. I need the architectural plans, but they're not online anywhere. So I'm going to need paper copies. Now, the architect's name is Chip. Peterson. This was his first big commission, and the office is down in Backlot City. All right. Franklin, you go tell him for a little while, and then we'll talk. All right, dog, I got you. Try not to hurt yourself. Oh, good, good, good. Okay. That's it. Wonderful. Okay. So we have a new mission. New wonderful things, and we got our name in the moon. Nice. Life is good. And it will get even better next time. But you will join me, of course, or I will visit you and... I don't know what we'll do, but... You will be regretful. Anyways, I will see you all next time. Until then, bye!